We got $20 million out of government to build the first carbon fibre electric boats. Fundamentally, it wasn't about building those. It was, it was about re-kicking the New Zealand uh, boat building industry. We've got a really long sort of boat building heritage and history. Yeah. Like, how do you see this as part of that big journey? I think it's world class, it's enabling, it's really exciting. I mean, the beauty of New Zealand is, um, you know, it's, it's one structure, it's one government. We deal essentially with one regulator. As you were talking about enabling the boat building industry, there's the boat builders themselves. None of the regulations here, so we've had to work with the regulator to enable all of that. With that comes all the learning. The long term of that is the boats will then have to be looked after, so you've got a whole new education around how you look after electric boats, how you look after foiling boats, how you look after carbon fibre boats, all of which is being developed uh, in-house and in New Zealand, all of which is scalable. It's really exciting. It's a whole industry that lifts. And the whole point of that was to try and take at least the, the boat building industry in New Zealand, which is actually a little industry now, um, to be a billion dollar industry.